<laughs> Intro. Bullshit. Go. And then do 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 Hi, if this is your first time seeing this weird ass face, I run a little shop on the internet called Smoking Glue Guns. And today we're making more dice because that's kind of what I need to be doing at the moment. Regardless, today we're making some really cool, fun, funky, special dice. Fun facts, if you stick to, if you stick around until the end of this video, there'll be a sneak peek of a little uh, pop of glue guns action. Before we get started, if you enjoy this video, make sure you hit that subscribe. <laughs> if you enjoy this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure to leave a like while you're down there and also hit that bell to be notified of all my future uploads. Let's get started. So so today we are using two part epoxy resin by Total Boat. It takes forever and a year to mix it up. You literally have to mix it until your arms feel like they're gonna fall off and then you have to mix it some more. Basically what I'm looking for is when I pull the popsicle stick up out of the resin, I wanna make sure that it's clear. I completely forgot until recording this voiceover. I also did a baby dye in this video. It's not the baby dye that we're talking about here. This is my sprinkle cupcake, chocolate cake, chocolate cake baby dye. That's a weird sentence. I ended up giving this one away because I did a TikTok push so I could get a stat block from a fellow TikToker, Papa Lycan. Editor Josh, you should totally put that video in here now. Do it, you weren't, you're not gonna do it. You're not gonna do it. You're gonna ignore me because I'm being bossy and you're the producer and you're in charge of video content so you can put in whatever you want to put in. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna put in some fucked up shit. Right? <laughs> Master Skywalker, there are too many of them. What are we going to do? Josh is a spite-filled demon. Regardless, whenever I'm making the baby dice, I do sort of have to jab them in there with a popsicle stick to sort of get them to fall where I want them to fall. So there's lots of just like dropping in a couple and then smushing them around with a popsicle stick. This one specifically, I wanted to do a chocolate cupcake, which is why we used brown babies. Again, I'm aware that this is really messed up. And it's also 42. <laughs> it's 42 babies because 42 is the meaning of life. There's <laughs> is baby. It's a fun joke. It's a fun joke. I should stop doing the joke now. Oh, okay, so ginger snap, excellent, cool, fan-fucking-tastic. So now that we have the cupcake die out of the way, we're gonna be working on the Son of Midas die, which I know is what this video is, but like, you guys got two baby die for the price of one, okay? So just appreciate that. And we're gonna be using some of the glitter that I got from Glitter Hippo. Fun facts, Glitter Hippo, a few videos back, sent me 30 different bags of glitter. You should check that video out. It's a good video, and it also made a really pretty die, which is available in the shop right now, but regardless, we're using ginger snap, which is a really pretty gold gold glitter with the babies that we're gonna be adding, which yes, are also gold. They don't make gold babies like that. So I had to make them gold, which meant I spent a lot of time spray painting the babies. And then at one point the wind blew the babies away. So I had to spend like 10 minutes crawling around on my hands and knees in the grass, picking golden babies out of the grass that was my backyard. And now we're gonna shove them in this resin mold. Now, originally my plan was to only add a little bit of the gold, but then I ran out of clear. So we improvised and we just added as much of the gold sparkle glitter bits as we wanted to. So with the rest of the glitter, I don't remember what I made. So we're gonna go on this journey together. Oh, and that's the Zetus Lapidus dice, which are very cool. You should check out Glitter Hippo. This isn't supposed to be a Glitter Hippo plug, but I'm gonna plug Glitter Hippo again because all of their glitters are really freaking pretty and I like them all quite a bit. I have to pause. What? <laughs> so I got a text message that I cannot say while I am recording audio. Hold on, I'm gonna screenshot it because you don't need to see the rest of the conversation. <laughs> You know what I want? I want cookout. I'm gonna go to cookout. <laughs> I'm gonna go to cookout. Look, 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 look. Have you had cookout? Do you know what cookout is? We don't have that out here. That's only in the Carolinas. I'm so disappointed in you. In me? Yeah, it's your fault. Why? It's your fault. Cookout. Cook cookout. Cookout, cookout is great. No, you know what? You know what? In the middle of this video, I'm going on a rant about cookout. Cookout is great. Do you want to know why? Because cookout is open until like two o'clock in the morning. So like if I want to go and get a cheeseburger and cheese fries at one o'clock in the morning, I can go do that. They have this thing called a cookout cookout tray where I can get like a cheeseburger or chicken or nuggets or two hot dogs or like corn dogs or whatever the hell I want. And then I can mix whatever side I want. I can get onion rings, like fried cheese cubes or like tater tots. There, there's so many options. And then you get a big old drink and I can get like Dr. Pepper or Coke or whatever, or like one of their like a bajillion milkshakes because they have just a wall of milkshake options. Cookout is objectively freaking awesome. And now I really want cookout. Sorry, what did you say? Did you just like not listen to anything I just said. I hate you. 
24 hours later. Why does it say 24 hours? Oh, it's because it goes into the pressure pot for 24 hours. We're good. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> they go into the pressure pot for 24 hours. So after the dye has spent 24 hours in the pressure pot, it's time to devold it. So the first thing I have to do is trim off the sprue. I use a little set of pliers and do that. And then I trim the tape off and then we pop it out and it just pops out really easy. Not like my dad demold dice. Those, I intentionally know that there's ways I can make that easier for him to demold. But like, where's the fun in that? So once the dye's out, I just have to take an X-Acto blade and trim off some of that extra flashing. But I love the way the babies look like they're being birthed out of the gold sparkles. It just looks really, really cool. So yeah, we also demolded the chocolate cake sprinkle one. I didn't necessarily love that the sprinkles fell to the top, but then once I showed this to people, they were like, oh, but it looks more like a cupcake now because the top of it has all the sprinkles at the top. Why are you about to cry? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> So the next step in this process, once I've done trimming off all the stuff, is to uh, sand it. Why does it say bonus footage? What is here? What did you do? <laughs> Why on earth did you keep that? Why'd you have to go make things so complicated? Make like there's just something about me. Oh, I forgot I was listening to Pandora. Okay, okay, so for context, when I'm mixing resin, I have my Pandora station open. I was listening to early 2000s, but complicated actually playing. And y'all can't, that's, that's a bop. Avril is like, got me through high school. Suck it, I don't care. Life's like this I deeply appreciate that, like, it's through the respirator. Honestly, you're like 600 milliliters. I'm just making up songs. Oh, dear Lord. Why do I just send you footage with audio? We're gonna gloop it into the cup, so mix it up. It's resin. <laughs> That shouldn't be this funny. Oh, fuck. Gonna do the thing and it's gonna be great. The camera's gonna shake because it's not secured well, but it's fine. <laughs> Are we done now? Oh dear lord. Oh. I actually really like this dye. It's ridiculous and absolutely absurd. And I knew I wanted to make a golden dye as soon as I got golden babies in. And now we have done the thing. We've made golden demon baby. This dye actually won't be in my shop updates. I'll have it at my in-person shows to check out and buy there. But if you would like one, you are more than welcome to hit up that commission tab at smokingglueguns.com. I want to take a quick second to thank all of my awesome patrons who enable me to do what I do. If you're interested in being a patron and supporting the chaos that is this channel, make sure you check that link, check that link, click that link link down below. Thank you to all my patrons for your support. I literally couldn't do this without you. Here's a sneak peek of the next dad theme molds. I don't know what's in there. It's from Joe. Joe made me my baby Yoda. It was cool. Is Joe cool? Is he really? Yeah. What's in a box? What the fuck is that? It's a funky looking tarantula baby. What the fuck is that? Jesus. Oh, that's just a whole a ass head. head. This, is this looks like the, it looks like the thingy from, um, from Toy Story. It looks kind of like, like. Oh, the Toy Story yeah, thing. Yeah. Like Joe, you're a sick fuck. <laughs> you mean it with all the love and sincerity that I can muster. <laughs> you're what I will do is I will put this in my work van. Do you want me to like paint it and put it in a dye? No, Joe sent this to me for reasons unknown. More than likely because he's a sick fuck, which is why he gets along well with everybody here. <laughs> oh, you little crazy fucks. Can I keep the container at least? No, Joe gave this to me. Look, this says Papa Blue Guns on it. Where's the rest of the body, Joe? <laughs> What's in a box? It's like fat black rat tape. <laughs> do you want me to paint it? But no, Joe gave this to me. Yeah, I want to like... leave it pristine. I want to leave his craziness in its original form. Yeah, you can keep that. I yeah, you can keep it. This is fucked up. You're fucked up, Joe. But I love you. That's all for now. I will see you guys in the next one. See you later, glue sticks.